I moved out here to Los Angeles to chase my dreams. And, and I've almost caught them, okay? I am this close, but not close enough to make any of you jealous. Um, I am trying to be a TV writer, and right now I am an assistant on a TV show, or as my mom likes to call it, one big vacation. <laughs> yeah. Must be nice. That's how she always starts everything. Must be nice to be so rich that you can move to Hollywood and not care what your family thinks of you. Must be nice. And that's not true, all right? Because I am not rich. <laughs> I'm not. And my family has trouble uh, distinguishing between working in TV and living inside the big shiny box. You know what I mean? They think my life is straight out of an episode of Extra. Lunch at the Ivy with Nicole, shopping at Kitson with Paris, drinks with MK at Hyde. Yesterday, I had to get lunch for 30 network executives, all of whom have eating disorders disguised as food allergies from a restaurant where nobody speaks a word of English. I totally should have taken Japanese in college because that would have been a lot more useful than the stuff I did take. I mean, where was my course in how to find American Idol tickets for a spoiled millionaire the night before the show when he's neither dying of cancer nor famous enough to sit right behind Paula? <laughs> they don't teach you that in college. The most practical thing I learned in college was never to drink anything out of a funnel, a trash can, or something served by a guy named Dirty Rob. <laughs> Good times. But I'm chasing the dream, people. You know, 14-hour days, minimum wage. But every once in a while, Christina Applegate rubs my arm and knows my name. <laughs> yeah, must be nice, my mom says, hanging out with celebrities instead of your family must be nice. Now, if, if I were living my mom's dream, I would have six kids live around the corner and we'd go power walking at the Super Walmart every day. And that totally could have happened had I been popular enough to get laid in high school. <laughs> Who's sorry now that they didn't let me wear makeup, huh, mom? Who's sorry now?